when we win, a lot of people's gonna have egg on their face. He's gonna see something and feel something on Saturday night that he's never seen before. Anthony Yard by Kale. Stanley, thanks for joining me. Uh, we're in the arena. That's where they're gonna build the ring. This is where Kovalev's fans are gonna sit. You've come face to face with him and face to face with Buddy McGurk. Any new thoughts on what on this fight and what might happen once the first bell sounds? First off, there's gonna be yard fans there as well. <laughs> Neutral crowd, partisan crowd. Um, thoughts? Any new thoughts? No, exactly the same. I know the task at hand and uh, I'm as confident today. I'll be confident on Thursday, Friday and Saturday I'll be even more confident. Sunday I'll be in Shake Shack in Russia having a burger. <laughs> <laughs> and a milkshake. And a milkshake. When, when, we're, when we're at the press conference, there was a really odd kind of press conference, not that many people there. Yes. And you were really close to Sergey. You know, you were six feet yes. away from him. Did you sense a different Sergey, a more relaxed Sergey? Or did you sense a man that is under pressure because it's his hometown? What, were your, what, what, what did you feel when you were sitting that close to him? Well, I don't need to be that far or that close to somebody to feel them to feel their presence, because everything is energy. And um, How was his energy when you were sitting there? The same as I thought it was six months ago, in February, when I watched him in Atlantic City. In the rematch? In the re uh, no, in the first match. So, so Sorry, last year, last in, the year match, yeah. in the first match. I felt it then, and I, I, tap, I remember tapping Anthony and saying, damn, he got there before us. Because, you know, when, you know, Anthony's referred to as a lion. Well, I mean, we're all lions. That's why it's lions in the camp. And uh, when a lion senses fear, <laughs> it's good night. Did you sense fear? Absolutely. When you're in the presence of Sergei Kovalev, and more so, you sense some more fear. More so, if you look, everyone knows when it's a face-off, it's my face-off as well. Yeah. <laughs> I'm right in there. You get your face in the picture. I get my face cut. I'm looking. I'm, I keep telling people. It's me and Anthony in there, yeah, yeah. regardless of what it looks. As one. As one. And um, he broke his concentration three times. He looked at me. That's fear. You know, during the so-called face-off, 100%. He was looking at you. When I walked up, he looked at me twice. No, two and three times, twice. And uh, I said to myself, uh-oh. <laughs> you ain't focused. You're looking at the wrong thing. You know, the person that you got to deal with is Anthony Yard. And those things to me, told me a lot. But he seems so relaxed. He seems so comfortable. No, he's not relaxed. <laughs> That's your perception. He's not relaxed. In fact, the reporter pulled him up on it. He ain't from Chelebrinks. <laughs> like, he's well, from the, the region. <laughs> he's from the region. We're like, where are you? Like, I ain't never seen you in Chelebrinks. So this is what happened. My dad always used to say to me, a liar should have a good memory. But <laughs> <laughs> What did you say? I forgot. But he never does. <laughs> He never does. <laughs> and, um, you know, the story is being played out exactly how I wanted it to be play out, played out. And I, I guess for Anthony, it's being played out the way he wants it mm. to be played out. The main thing and the, the, the most important thing that me and Anthony have the same goal in mind. Mm. And that's victory on Saturday. And that victory comes with validation of your methods, yes. his belief in you, yes. your belief in him. And also his methods. Yeah, of course. He, Anthony, you, he's a, you surely, you know, your system yes. surely also has, has helped, has been involved with the help of him. Oh, absolutely. Because, Learning because process. It's like I always used to say to people, you know, it's called plug and socket. <laughs> yeah. You know, uh, one doesn't work without the other. It's something that I've campaigned for, for trainers in this country and... I guess eventually all over the world, to take more credit. You know, be confident in yourself. You've played a part, you're sacrificing, you're in the gym with And them. not just be a mercenary. And not just be a mercenary, not be someone. I mean, look, Buddy McGirt was in the crowd. <laughs> Where was he? He was supposed to be out front. He's with Sergey every day. But this is what I'm trying to say. Sergey said, he's seen this before. He said, 
he's, he's seen fighters talk like this and no, you ain't, Sergey. <laughs> you haven't seen the AY and the you Tunnel. Think, you think you're bringing in the new stuff? He's going to see something and feel something on Saturday night that he's never seen before. In fact, you're going to have to go back a long way to see another AY and TA. I'm talking Cuss, Tyson. That's how close we are. That's the kind of bond. That's the that bond me got. and um, that's the bond me and Anthony have, and you know, and that's why my name was up there. Mm. And because, that's why you were up there. And that's why I'm up there. It, it, you know, it's not abracadabra. It's not mm. magic. Some magical. Problem. We've worked hard. We develop a system. Anthony's got his own system of study, and the two of us combined mm. has created this moment. Let's let's talk about. Russia. Let's talk about where we are. Now, I know the people have been polite to you. Yes. I know you've seen nice statues and you've had some nice fruit for breakfast and the arena's nice and the black coffee's nice and the black yes. bread that goes with the bullshit. I know that. But <laughs> would you much would you rather and and, and I mean I want to honestly like, would you rather we were in London or Manchester or New York or Madison Square Garden? Or does it really not matter to you? Truthful. I'm always truthful. What, 99.9% .9 of the time? <laughs> it's that 1%. <laughs> it's just that 1% percent you got to worry about. <laughs> no. I'm happy he's here. Okay. Because Anthony Fowler, Anthony, I'm giving you a bit of <laughs> promotion here. He said it, he tweeted it yesterday. He said, and he used the wrong word. I'll rephrase it. When we win, mm. a lot of people's going to have egg on their face. Mm. Because I've been mocked, I've been vilified, I've been you criticized. Have. You have. Criticized. And it's like I always say to people, I always say to them that results speak for themselves. Mm. Regardless of what anyone says, regardless of what anyone thinks. I mean, I've had to apply my trade in an environment where I know everybody doesn't like me. Um, but I believe in myself. Your critics are queuing up to give you a kick. Let's get, yes. I mean, let's, let's not beat around the bush. You oh, know, course. You know, it, there are people in the trade yes. that admire you. There are people yes. in the trade that respect you. Yes. Um, there are people. Those are the ones that I focus on. Yeah, and, yeah, and there, there, and there are people in the trade that maybe don't necessarily agree with your methods, but still respect you. Yes. And, and, and there's nothing wrong with that. But sorry, Steve, I have to cut you. Go on. The people that don't agree with me. Yeah. The people that don't respect me. Have they ever been at this level? Mm -hmm. <laughs> that, and, that, and that's your argument. And you've, had, and you've had some famous battles with people. This is what I'm trying to say. Over and I shouldn't battle with them. I shouldn't, Steve, because I'll tell you why. As Anthony said yesterday, it's a losing battle. Mm. The best way to change someone's thought or opinion or belief is turn up, show up, blow up, prove it. And Saturday night, those individuals, because there's not many of them, are going to have to look for another excuse. It's safe to say that you're looking forward to this fight. Oh, man, I'm so excited. You can't I, I wait, was, can you? Uh, did he? You've been throwing punches. I've been seeing it. I've been watching it, yeah. <laughs> Show it. <laughs> but that's... <laughs> it's going to be beautiful. Beautiful, as my dad says. <laughs> <laughs> so, if I had to ask you for a prediction... Yes. You know, no, we're not talking about crystal ball, but... Yes. Would you give me a prediction? Would you tell me how you think? Or no, how you know? You see, I'm even, I'm even turning myself. I'm That's understanding the, the you're, you're very influential. Yeah, so, 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 what, so you, what comes out of your mouth <laughs> is important. So, so, so I need you talking the talk. The talking the talk, yeah. <laughs> so, so tell me then. What, yes. T tell me what happens. Look in my eyes, Steve. I am. Anthony Yard by Kale. It could even be the first round. That's what I believe. It could be the ninth round. It could be the tenth round. But... In my heart and in my mind, and what I've seen of Anthony Yard from the very start, go back and watch the tapes on BT. I said all this. Yeah, this is not some man who suddenly got to this point and then started getting all and acting out of character. Mm. I've, ne I've always been like this. It, it, before people knew me in boxing, the people that I grew up with in Peckham, Brixton, South London, New Cross, West London, the whole of London, they know, they, they know the kind of person I am. And, I just won't change that. And I'm, I'm very confident in Anthony. I'm happy for Anthony. Well, I know one thing, Tundi. People say, oh, they're overconfident. Oh, him and Yard, they're overconfident. <laughs> it's not. It's just you have a belief. But you say overconfident. First of all, we wasn't even supposed to fight. First of all, we wouldn't take the fight. Mm. First of all, I heard... It wasn't going to happen. It wasn't going to happen. Sergey so wasn't going to come. <laughs> was, you know, weren't going to get visas. We weren't going to get a visa. That, that was... This is what I'm trying to say. <laughs> Dream it. 
believe it, become it. Point one, ticked. Point two, ticked. Saturday night, AY and the TA become it. AY and the TA, third tick. Tandy, it's always a pleasure. Yes, sir. Always a delight talking to you. Thank you very much, Steve.